Conversation with Imam Sadiq alayhi salam, and then he said, "I prefer. I have reached the position that I prefer illness to health, poverty to rich, because he had understood all these points." But Imam Sadiq alayhi salam said, "We Ahlul Bayt are pleased with whatever Allah is pleased with us." Okay, so. It's not that we say to Allah, make me ill, make me poor, make me lose my children. No, we don't volunteer for suffering. Okay? We ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to give us the best of the best. But if something happens, and it's not because of your bad behavior, then you should be happy. If it's because of your bad behavior, you have to do toba and you have to change yourself. So when a mu'min goes through difficulty, has to check, was it caused by me? For example, if I have an accident, I should see, was I not driving carefully? Maybe I was not driving carefully, now I have an accident. I have, a, for example, a child who is not a good child. His akhlaq, his morality is bad. Okay, I should check. Did I do my best in upbringing him Islamically? If I didn't do my best, then I should blame myself. I shouldn't expect you know, reward from Allah for what I didn't do. But if I have done my best, if I have made my efforts, then for this suffering, I will be rewarded. I was driving carefully, but someone came and hit me. I was walking carefully on the street. Someone hit me. And I am now ill, till disabled, till end of my life. Allah is going to compensate. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is compensating for any suffering that you have as long as you were not yourself guilty you were not yourself careless even for them maybe somehow Allah would still compensate if a person repents maybe for example when I was going to get married I was not careful I was very young I didn't have experience now I cannot say I am not responsible. But what can I do? I want to be patient. So Allah says, okay, if you have taken your lesson, now I'm going to accept your patience and reward you. Mm -hmm.